Hello everyone and welcome back to another Roaring Records tutorial. Today we're going to be continuing our idea of creating rhythmic interest. Uh, this time we're still going to be working in Soundtrap and with our same project, but we're going to be looking at creating risers and downers. Risers and downers are really common in electronic music and we want to check out and see a few different ways that we can add those risers and downers to our music. So uh, there's a couple ways that I'm going to go about doing this. Uh, one, I'm going to mute this introduction. And so I'm just going to right click on that and hit mute region. So all I've done is silence this region. The rest of the drum parts can still be heard. But I want to add a riser to the beginning of this um, piece. So I'm going to click on my loop section. And I've always referred to them as risers, but they are also called sweeps. And that's what uh, Soundtrap likes to call them. So you can get in here and find some different sweeps. Let me give you some examples. Or this. Or this. So you get the basic idea of what a sweep actually is, or a, as I like to call them, risers. So when you find one you like, you can select it and drag it over. Now the important thing to adjust here is that it arrives at the moment that the impact of the song happens. So I'm going to check out by zooming in where that moment is. Looks like this is the most intense moment of that clip right here. So that's where I want it to arrive at. Now let's see what the effect is for the song here. Okay, so there we've added a nice little sweep to happen. Uh, we could add another one in. Maybe here. Nice ways to add emphasis um, as opposed to a sweep. You can also look for things that go down. I like to call them downers instead of uh, risers. Let's see. This downshifter. So there's an idea. It's not quite so uh, noise-based, but it still works as a downer. You could have that come in here. So these are ways that you can add emphasis to phrase endings and beginnings. These all lead into moments where something new happens. So you can do downers and risers and uh, many different things. Um, oftentimes they're also included in the sound effects uh, folder. So there's another good downer that you could potentially use right off the bat, the sound effects for a swish sub drop. Would be cool to add at the ending. So lots of different things that you could do there um, to check out and add rhythmic instrument rhythmic interest using risers and downers or in this case we call them sweeps i uh, hope you found this helpful if you enjoyed it hit that subscribe button below thank you